known to display her cheekier side when she appears in public over the years, and this occasion was no exception. It was an emotional day for the royal family and the British public as a special memorial service was held at Westminster Abbey nearly a year after the Duke of Edinburgh's death, and the most senior members of the royal family from the UK and abroad turned up in their dozens along with the adult royals were favourite Prince William. Kane, who was Charlotte's supporter, saw her nervousness and leaned in to say, You can smile, let's go in, according to rumours that the Prince of Wales told his son before leading him into the abbey and introducing him to the memorial's guests. While Prince George, Charlotte's sibling, continued to maintain his usual grave expression, Charlotte grinned at four cameras. In the future, Charlene seemed to click with the Archbishop of Canterbury once they were presented to the senior clergy. As her mother Kate Middleton grinned alongside them, the two were spotted exchanging giggles. Once the youngsters were seated, several watchers saw the humorous moment where Princess Charlotte pulled a silly look. On Twitter, a few admirers made fun of the fact that the kids had turned the camera on her and that's why she gave the expression. A tweeter who captured the scene on camera claimed she had this park in her. You appear on TV in that way. Princess Charlotte and the Duchess walked together as the royal family left Westminster Abbey. The young prince looked great with a topcoat and a deep navy color that included intricate buttons. Stockings in a contrasting color and black flats completed the ensemble. The princess had the rest of her hair draped over her shoulders and part of it was pulled back in a half-do for the event. The princess has matured, many people have noted. Her resemblance to her father, Prince William, was also highlighted by royal enthusiasts. Sorry Kate, they both had the same looks and emitted the same sneer with no teeth, so people noticed that as well. Every day, Prince George's appearance resembles his father a little bit more. At the memorial service, the father and son were enjoying a 20-minute period when their coordinated attire was discovered. Prince George complimented the Prince of Wales's navy blue suit with a blue and white polka while the prince himself wore a similar outfit with a stripe. Charlotte's sassier side was occasionally displayed in addition to their enduring presentation for this occasion. She also made a big impression at the christening of her younger brother, Prince Louis, in 2018. She said, you're not coming, to the assembled cameras and media as she and her family exited the church for a celebration at Clarence House. Charlotte's whacking of a royal assistant was also entertaining. Normally, the royal will give the help flowers to carry so they may chat to other well-wishers and have their hands free, but Charlotte had grown very attached to her flowers and when the help offered to carry them, she declined and glanced at her head. As she and the rest of her family walked back to Sandingham House, the princess clung to the flowers with both hands. By Katie, Rolex Charlotte is the most vivacious and outgoing of the three Cambridge kids, according to Nicole, and it's her character strength that will serve her well as she gets older.